is a comfortable 68 degrees with the wind blowing out to center field. And the pitch to Holiday is ripped to right field. That'll be a base hit. And it gets under the glove of Grossman and goes to the wall. And Holiday goes to second. And he's passenger seat. <laughs> you, you wish there was a break on that side. There's not. But that kind of experience is really valuable to a young driver. Jackson Holiday hits one back up through the middle on the second base side. And that's going to score Bamuelos from second base. Lefty set. Here comes the pitch. And it's going to be swung on and sliced down the left field line. Goes opposite field. Gets it inside the line. It doesn't strike, right. so there's no speeding that up. Here's a drive, and that one is going to get off the wall in right center field. Another hit, another double, a third one of the game for Jackson Holiday. Now it's a 21-8 to eight game, and that sets a new ballpark record for an opponent with hits with 25 tonight for the Norfolk Tides. And a 3-1 pitch. Here it is. Swing and a smash up the first base line. That's a fair ball. And it's go all, it'll go all the way into the corner. And Kerstad is into second base with an RBI double. The Tides take a 1-0 lead. Holiday coming around from second base. A couple of times in front of the pitching rubber, the left foot. Now the 1-2. Swung on, sent out to right field. This could be the third home run of the inning. And it is into the right field seats. Another two-run shot. Make that a three-run shot. Kerstad makes it 15 to 8. Tides have batted around. Two on Kerstad. Next one is hit in the air. Center field. Back goes Ortega at the track, at the wall, and that ball's gone. It's a grand slam. And Kerstad has 10 RBIs tonight, and it's now 26 to 8. Kerstad hits his second home run for the second day in a row. And it's now a 10 RBI night. And I don't believe in all the years I've been doing this, I've seen somebody knocking 10 runs. Traded by the Dodgers to the White Sox. Here's the pitch. Swing and a line drive. That is a fair ball down the right field side, just inside the line. Another extra base hit. It is a double for Stowers. And now the lead is four to two. As one of the six home runs hit by the Norfolk Tides. And he drives this one deep to right. And that one is going to get out of the ballpark in the upper deck of the Atrium Health home run porch. And the Norfolk Tides take a 3 0 lead in the top of the first inning. Seven home runs already in this series for the Tides. And that is the second one for Stowers. Who now for the Norfolk Tides. 8-8 eight, eight game, top of the six. Curveball's hammered down the right field line. If it stays fair, that's going to be trouble, and it is trouble. It's a home run. Stowers, his second home run of the game, another two-run shot, and that propels the Tides back in the lead, 10-8. Third home run of the series for Kyle Stowers. Fourth on the year. The count is two and two. Pitch to Stowers. Swing and a high fly left center. And that one's at the track. It's at the wall. It's in the bleachers. Deja vu all over again. Six home runs last night. Six home runs today. My oh my. What are we watching? It is. Uh, it has been difficult for the Knights pitching staff. You got to feel for them because right now no matter who is out there. They are really. Now the pitch, and it's hammered towards right center field. That ball's hit well, and it's going to get off the wall. On his way to second base is Mayo. Going for third. And now he wants to try for three. Here's the throw. And the pitch, swing, broken bat line drive to center for a base hit. Another run is in. Going first to third is Kerstad, so Mayo has his fourth hit, first RBI. Padilla ready to fire. Here comes the one two to the plate and the one out pitch is swung on sent high out to left field drifting back to the wall. It's Deloach and it's going to be up and over the wall for a home run lands on the roof of the Piedmont natural gas picnic area. So Norby has his second home run in as many games. Nobody on so just one run the damage. 
you don't have to drop your eyes below yeah. the dash horizon, which is helpful too. The 0-2, it's a hard smash out to left field. That's going to get down. That's going to be some trouble. Holiday is going to be waved around from third base. Here comes the relay from Deloach, and holding on to his Remel Arts. That's going to be an RBI double for Norby. And now the tide's going to Mendick is going to work the ninth inning. Nice trail 25 to 11. Here's a swing and a drive, and it's now 26 to 11. And that is the uh, the eighth home run tonight hit by the Norfolk Tides. And Burdick had one overturned earlier down in right field around the foul pole. It was called a home run initially. They changed it after the umpires got together. No doubt on this one way back in the bleachers. And it's now 26 to 11. They've scored in every inning except for the second tonight. Crazy. I mean, we have seen that, not to this extent. 